And we talked a little bit about obinutuzumab, a next generation anti-CD20. Uh, it's purported to have better ADCC uh, in contrast to rituxan. And while there are many, many studies looking at uh, various roles for obinutuzumab in B cell malignancies, I talked specifically about uh, the Gadolin study. And the Gadolin study was a study led by uh, Laurie Sen and uh, Bruce Chesson that looked at uh, patients with refractory follicular lymphoma. So this is a population that has failed CD20 and failed alkylator-based treatment. And there's not a lot generally available for these patients. So the Gadolin study compared uh, obinutuzumab plus bendamustine followed by obinutuzumab maintenance versus bendamustine alone. There was no anti-CD20, no rituxan, because that population was felt to be refractory and unlikely to benefit.